So the first cycle starts with this chord. You can see it there probably. You start on 12 with a golpe, 12, and then you do this rascal on each uh, beat of the compass. So it is ring finger down, index down, index up, and you take your ring finger up with you as well. This is one of the Rasgel, and you can practice it. So you can get it smooth, smooth and relaxed. First, you want to practice also this pull off and hammer on. You can do upstrokes with your index finger here. You should practice this kind of pattern uh, where you do a downstroke and a golpe on the accents. And I'll just show you, and I think you'll learn it better like this. That would be. And then the rest 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So now you have 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And practice that until you until you know how to do this this uh, pull off and hammer on. And then we can proceed um, to how to actually execute this thing. So you start on 12 with a golpe, 12, and then you do each beat of the compass, this rascal. So that would be 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Now that we are in 9, the 10 is index down and golpe. And you basically do 10, 11, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So now we have one and a half cycles done. And then the end from 6. Uh, if, when you when you come from 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and now comes a little bit tricky part where the 6 is 6, 6 and you do a pull off here on the first string and right after this move you take your middle finger up here and do a downstroke and then a pull off here with your middle finger. So After this uh, middle finger down and uh, pull off, you take your thumb to the same string that you just pulled off, so fourth string. Okay, and then you follow from from here 
with a middle finger here and index finger on the first fret and then a free. So Recap 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, and from here you, uh, you take this chord, right? You move to this chord right when you play this. So, and then you play this note and this note as well. But this note in particular is a different one because you do a golpe and downstroke with your thumb and and uh, alza pua, al alza pua, alza pua. And on the upstroke of the alto pull, you pull off this string here. So 10, 11, 12. So this basically here is 12. 12, 1, 12, 1. 10, 11, 12, uh, 10, 11, 12, 1. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2. So, after this, 12, 12, 1, 12, 1. So you basically have this chord, which is uh, A major 7. And you play a downstroke with your index finger. So C. So this is actually quite simple. 12, 1, 2, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Except you do a golpe. 3, 4, 5, and the upstrokes. 2, 3, 4, 5. 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then you end this on six but you do it like this six. so you do a golpe and index down and index up but you mute it right after and you can mute with your left hand or your right hand so basically six, seven. Ten, eleven, and then you just wait for the rest of the cycle, and the falsetto starts on twelve. So twelve. That wasn't the smoothest, smoothest possible though. That's more like it. Okay, and now we can actually start with the falsetta here. And the falsetta starts with this chord. Well, we have we have this chord in the start. The falsetta starts like this. Okay. And uh, let me just show you the first part of it. And here, 
I will break this down soon, but the start is on 12, 12, 1, and this is the 6, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So, how to play this? You have this chord, then you do a downstroke on the thumb and a golpe, and then you have your index finger landing on the second fret of the fourth string and you do a hammer on and pull off okay and from here you take your middle finger to the third fret of the fifth string and from here you take the first fret of the fifth string with your index finger but you do it with a legato and this is important here you have to do a alza pua right after you land on the first fret so from 1st fret up to 3rd and then a free 4th string and then back to this note here This note here, and then you do a, a pull off, which is the six. Six. So twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six. Twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay. Second cycle starts the same, but from here so. So instead of six, seven, eight, you have six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You take this chord is your middle finger on the 3rd fret of 5th string and the 2nd fret of the 4th string, uh, your index and then you have your ring finger on the 3rd string on the 3rd fret and your pinky finger or little finger on the 3rd fret of the 2nd string so, so the first cycle Second one. Twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And then the third one starts the same. Twelve, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, this is actually a little bit different here. And right after this, it goes here. So. This is with gold. And with golpe you do a legato with your middle finger and your index finger on the fourth string. And right 
right after this, you take the third fret of the fifth string with your middle finger. Okay. And then after this note, you do a uh, downstroke with the thumb here. fast legato so and you leave this to play or to the ring You count this twelve, one, two, three, four, five. Wait. So let's count this twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, ten, eleven, twelve. So this legato here. So on three of the next cycle you do a pull off here. So twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So that's basically it. And let's recap this. So that ought to do it, and and yes, I have a nice tip to practice this. So you can you can actually make a nice uh, nice loop out of this if you do uh, six, 